Hello everybody, I am Gaurav from Apagine Solutions Private Limited. Today I am going to explain about uh, uh, Gantt chart in project management. We had developed this uh, particular Gantt chart to track all sort of uh, activities going on in any operation and maintenance project or any construction project. Uh, we, we created some sort of groups in this uh, Gantt chart so that we can check out the progress whatsoever is going on in the project. In terms of activity name, project, site location, customer, assigned to, supervisor, stage, company, last message. So by these groups we can track our project progress. If you want to customize these particular groups as per your need you can go to add custom group then you can select any group you want like uh, company after selecting this particular group company you have to click upon apply as soon you apply company it will show the company name MSD Telematics Private Limited so it will show like uh, what all projects are going on in this particular time duration for this company in this company what all projects in this project what all activities in this activity what all resources are engaged and uh, to whom what we have assigned so we, if we click on assign to it will show the person name at present there are no many there there are not uh, many users configured uh, to this particular uh, section so this is a demo and uh, we have administrator so this is saying like uh, we have assigned this particular activity for to administrator so in in uh, after assign to we can select stage so it will show like in what what stage this particular project is into so they, these are the dimensions in which we can do analysis from Gantt chart after this we can create certain level of filters if you want active filters okay so we can create filters like stock moves for stock moves we can create filter is equal to is not equal to greater than less than greater than or equal to less than or equal to is set is not set so this way we can create filter and we can create some more conditions if we want condition you can see like if you want to, to add filter for this particular permutation combination or, or this particular permutation combination apply so this I am going to uncheck so that you can see more and more fields. So this is the way we can use this particular Gantt chart. And if you want to drag, like uh, this is showing only 30 days. So we can check till and what is going on and uh, what is pending of project project performance like name activity 4 activity 4 start date 1 10 2019 start time 15 43 44 end date 30 10 2019 end time 15 43 44 deadline it will show true or false if met if deadline is met then it will show true otherwise false and in progress it will show the percentage of work done thank you i think uh, you have got an idea of what uh, we have in our gantt chart hope you like this video and uh, please let me know if you want to get it configured in your project management system thank you thank you so much for your watching